जहाँ डाल डाल पर सोने की चिड़िया करती है बसेरा वो भारत देश है मेरा वो भारत देश है मेरा
education and activities are two vital aspects of life. To find a balance in them is a skill in itself. The Millennium School truly believes that co-curricular activities are an integral part of the modern education system. This presentation is a small display of the exemplary talent of the Millennium students. Let go of the past and go for future. Go confidently in the direction of your dreams. Live the life you have imagined. Thank you. Greetings of the day. Shubham karo ti kalyanam al ghoyam thana sampatha. Shatru buddhi vinashaya deepa jyote namu sute. The traditional oil lamp defines the spiritual significance. The oil logi symbolizes our negative tendencies, which when read by spiritual knowledge slowly gets exhausted and the ego to finally precious. We always follow the tradition of lighting of lamp on all aspiration occasions. I would like to call upon our respected principal ma'am to light the lamp. Thank you. Objective and its approach. 
It allows the organization to differentiate itself from others. A mission is a core of any institution which prompts growth and change. For the mission, I would like to call upon Yash Vardhan Singh Tomar. Greetings of the day. Our school mission is Think Today, Change Tomorrow, Let's Build a Better World. Greetings of the day. With the new day comes new friends, new thoughts, and endless possibilities. So, to enlighten us and brighten our day, here comes Hardik Swankar with the thought of the day. The thought of the day is conserve water, conserve life, and you. The limits of my language are the limits of my universe. Our understanding of what we read and hear is to very large degree to determine by our vocabulary. So let's invite Karthike Kushwaha to enrich our vocabulary and share the word of the day. Thank you. Greetings of the day. The word of the day is conserve. We spell it as C-O-N-S-E-R-V-E, conserve. Its meaning is to protect something, especially something of environmental or cultural importance from harm or destruction. Thank you. Greetings of the day. Aristotle once said educating the mind without educating the heart is no education at all. Now I invite my Dear friends of Great Sports Day, to present their views on the top fake Legends of India drop PowerPoint presentation. Thank you. Rahul Parke, General Abdin Abdul Kalam was an Indian aerospace scientist who served as the 11th President of India from 2002 to 2007. He was born and raised in Rameshwaram, Tamil Nadu has studied physics and aerospace engineering. Thank you. Rabindranath Tagore, India's first Nobel laureate, was born in Kolkata on May 7, 1861. He was a poet, writer, playwright, composer, philosopher, social reformer and a painter. In 1913, Tagore became the first non-European to win a Nobel Prize in Literature. Thank you. Srinivasa Ramujan was an Indian mathematician who lived during the British rule in India. Dr. Bhim Ram Bedkar is popularly known as Baba Sahib Bedkar. He is a celebrated leader who flagged the constitution of India. He was a well-known statesman who fought for the rights of the Dalits and other social backward classes. Thank you. Vikram Ambalal Sarabhai was an Indian physicist and astronomer who initiated space research and helped develop nuclear power in India. He was honored with Padma Bhushan in 1966 and the Padma Vibhushan in 1972. He is internationally regarded as the father of the Indian space program. Today I am telling something about Jahangir Ratanji Dada Bhai Tata. Jahangir Ratanji Tata Bhai Dada Bhai Tata was the first licensed pilot in India and in the Pradyons and in the Emirates, chairman of Tata Group and founder of many industries. Thank you. Mother Teresa, 1997, was a Roman Catholic nun. A very good morning, dear parents. Someone has said that success usually comes to those who are too busy to be looking for it. These words have been truly justified by Dr. Manjula Goswami. Dr. Manjula Goswami has been an eminent educationist for the last 27 years. Ma'am had impeccable leadership qualities right from the inception of her school life. An educationist par excellence, Ma'am has presented papers at various universities and conferences. Ma'am's paper presented at the International Conference for Quality Control 
organized by Singapore Productivity and Control Board, was awarded as the most outstanding work. Ma'am has also won the Deming Award for her case study presented at the International Convention organized by the Malaysian Quality Control Board, Kuala Lumpur. Ma'am has been formally trained in the Kaizen Theory of Japan for quality management organized by Quality Control Forum of India. Ma'am has also attended a workshop for senior management at the Oxford University with regard to improvement in the education system. Ma'am's role with regard to child welfare, women empowerment, environment awareness and education has been acknowledged time and again. Ma'am has been accredited for her work by the Amity University and the Times of India Group. She has also been felicitated by Rotary Club for her contribution to education. PhD Chambers of Commerce and CIIYI have also recognized her outstanding inputs to education. In the recent past, the prestigious organization of Dubai, Bazme Urdu, felicitated Dr. Goswami for her contribution to the field of second language. She was honored by none other than Nawazuddin Siddiqui, Nandita Das, Sanjeev Sara, Shahbaz Khan, and Gajendra Singh. Ma'am's brilliance and dazzling performer outshines many. Ma'am received Gaurav Samman 2021 by Honorable Union Education Minister Dr. Ramesh Pokhriyal Nishant and Deputy Chief Minister of UP. Respected Ma'am was awarded by Rishihud University for her outstanding efforts in ensuring seamless education amidst the pandemic. Even during these tenuous times, Ma'am ensured that education of students is not hampered. Ma'am received the Education Warrior Award by the Times of India Group presented by Honorable Dr. Dinesh Sharma, Deputy Chief Minister of UP for her prominent role in the education field. And rightly so, being a warrior by ensuring that pandemic doesn't become an obstacle in the path of education. Recently, she was felicitated by Inspiration Academics Consultant for, giving, for guiding, advising and counseling students and parents during COVID-19 pandemic through a, live, through a live talk show. Not only has Ma'am left her mark in the field of education, she has been an avid supporter of various social causes. Ma'am is also associated with an online public awareness program launched by Women in Child Security Organization, Mission Shakti 1090. In the recent past, at a glittering function in Gurgaon by Education World, the Millennium School was ranked third in the entire country under the category of Emerging Schools of India. Lately, another feather added to Ma'am's cap was the Women Achievers Award organized by the Z News. Ma'am's journey in the field of education has also been listed in the book entitled Passionate Educationist, in which one entire chapter is dedicated to Ma'am. This incredible success has been a reward of continuous labor of a motivated staff and Kenosha management of Dr. Goswami. As a navigator of the school, she has been responsible for taking the school to new heights and sharing a course full of memorable feats. So ladies and gentlemen, with a huge round of virtual applause, let's welcome our principal ma'am, Dr. Manjula Goswami. A very warm welcome to my dear parents. On behalf of the Millennium School, South City Lucknow, I, Dr. Manjula Goswami, wish you all a very happy new year. With folded hands, eyes closed, the only offerings we ask from the Almighty above is, may each and every member of the Millennium family have a good sleep and they get up with a smile on their face. May all your loved ones have a healthy and long life. Ladies and gentlemen, I am reminded of March 2020, when the first lockdown appeared. And believe you me, we were the first school in the entire state to begin the online classes dot on time. Ladies and gentlemen, March, April 2020, we started with our classes of online and we've never looked back since then. The teaching learning process, be it teaching, the various techniques, strategies involved, the assignments, the assessments, everything right up to your PTM and the report card distribution has been so smooth only because of the extensive teaching and the trainings that we've been giving to all our staff. 
it was only a result of such good teaching learning process that the board results have been spectacular ladies and gentlemen the board result of 2021 and 2022 is still going on but i'm keeping my fingers crossed and last year we had the city topper and majorly most of our children were above 95% and everybody passed with distinction not just academically but even when i talk of children pursuing their heart's desire when i talk of children following their passion wherever i go to i have seen be it new york be it london be it bangalore be it calcutta be it the ivy league universities be it indian universities our children are doing so 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 well most importantly they are all very happy with what they are doing not just academics ladies and gentlemen mine was the first school in the entire state to have the first ever virtual concert and believe you me many heads of schools used to ask me concert virtually how does that happen and for all my parents who the old parents they know what a marvelous piece we had for concerts the virtual concert and yes we did have ladies and gentlemen the virtual art exhibition which was again a masterpiece because nobody has ever thought of having these exhibitions and i said no matter what happens the day to day teaching the academics the co curricular the exhibitions the concerts we will never stop them this year very proud to share with you that you know the children had also got into the grind of online teaching and the innovations spectacular ladies and gentlemen shikhar niyogi grade 10 his conference on eco buddies was amazing it was really amazing i had shared the zoom link with practically everybody and the eco conference was too good and again adit and adit sahani and adit mohan agarwal children who have been with me since nursery let me tell you they were the top 10 finalists of fiki flow budding entrepreneurs and they've done us so proud against uh, you know shreyansh mehrotra he has engineered the bat mobile ladies and gentlemen it's a sight to behold aro singhania he created his own school app called uh, especially on his school which nobody in that age group has even thought of doing it again the millennium school yours truly has been known for the kind of works we do we do and so much so that the women uh, power line 1090 had asked us to step in during the pandemic because of a lot of uh, you know uh, certain things happening in the town and my students my teachers we all are now uh, a part of 1090 my students go there as power rangers they go to homes to see that you know there's harmony in the home and wherever they be they, we were called upon our students perform the karnatak right down to the villages also again very proud to share that now it's been you know we are a very new school we just launched in 2009 10 yet from day one we had this partnership with the times of india and the times of india millennium cup was done again we just didn't do it last year because of severe pandemic but again you know 2021 it was spectacular ladies and gentlemen the honorable chief minister has already visited our school in the past and he was so happy to see the teaching learning process the first while late a former president dr kalam has visited our school also and this time the climate change conclave inaugurated by the chief minister our students were present for that conclave ladies and gentlemen very very happy to tell you all my teachers are vaccinated all my sub staff was vaccinated everybody as per the statutory compliances we were totally in place and that is why we had the vaccination drive 
and each and every teacher, sub staff, majorly most of the age group students are being vaccinated. And when all this started, we went into the hybrid mode and we welcomed our gates for the children to walk in. I was so happy when I saw pre nursery, nursery, KG, right up to grade 12, the students walking in. Of course, our process was very, very strict and we kept the health records and we've taken in an app also by Health and Go which immediately tells us the temperature of all the students every day. So all these uh, our SOPs were in place already and that is when we went in for hybrid and with the things which are happening all around the, uh, uh, you know, in India especially and around the globe, we do see that we would be opening our schools very, very soon again and hear the bitter part of the children feet in our school, you know, and the sound and looking forward to those smiling faces again. I hope parents that you are receiving the videos and that is for the entire Millennium family. Uh, right down from your grandparents to your parents and for the little ones also. Uh, so now we've started the dance is the first one and I really want all of you to take part in that, uh, you know, videos and dance as a family. And next week we are launching the yoga for the entire family and then there's going to be another art and craft and there's going to be dance again. So, you know, the pandemic also made me realize that uh, sometimes in some families things were not uh, you know going the way they should have been because you're cooped up inside all the time and that's why we decided for these week-long videos uh, my activity team had soft to them and they're doing a wonderful job and I'm looking forward I've already got some parents who've been sending me ma'am how do I look in my day three you know I'm sending you a video of day three up to day three so we would be doing this continuously till uh, things become normal again. And ladies and gentlemen, very, very, extremely proud to share with you that in the two years of the pandemic, our school has got more than a dozen awards, right down from the most emerging school of the country, uh, we were rank 3, you know, outstanding achievement for a new school, rank 3 of the country to best online teaching uh, during the pandemic. We've been getting number of awards only and only thank you so much to all my dear parents who have bestowed their faith on us. So much so that we've exceeded our number of admissions and we are not ready to take in even a single admission these days. And, uh, you know, people have really put their faith in us. And that is why our responsibility, our accountability and everything, I tell my teachers, don't even look at what the other schools are doing. This is your bar. Every year, you have to exceed what you did yourself. So, going ahead, ladies and gentlemen, uh, sincerely, my only last request to all of you is, please be safe. Let's not do stupid things which end us, you know, which, which may end up in a very wrong manner. Let's be safe. Let's remain healthy. And most important, let us respect, care and love each other as much as we can. The biggest of things can be conquered by care, respect and love. And again, I still say and I still believe in that your IQ never matters. It's your I can which matters, ladies and gentlemen. So let's determine ourselves furthermore. Come what may. The Millennium School is prepared and we will make sure that your children rise and shine globally. Thank you so much, my dear parents. Again, thank you very, very much for bestowing your trust and your little ones in my care. God bless us all. We dance for laughter, we dance for tears, we dance for madness. We dance for fears, we dance for hopes, we dance for screams. We are the dancers, we create dreams. So let's hear our voice in selecting task performance by the students of
great for tea. and staff members who put in a lot of effort in preparing the students. A very special note of gratitude to our dear principal ma'am for her unconditional support and guidance. I would also like to thank our dear parents for taking up their precious time and encouraging us. 